So this is the final reflection vlog for the Global Learning Project. Sadly, Shiksa could not make the vlog, so the second half of the vlog will be her reactions. Um, our schedules just did not meet for this last part. They did follow other parts, but this one part just flew under the radar. Um, so what are some things I feel differently about? Um, Prior to our first interaction, I didn't really, did not really think that there were such um, drastic differences in the culture of education in separate countries. Obviously, I aware that there were some differences, but I didn't realize that, like, systematically things were so different. Um, but hearing Shiksa describe it really opened my eyes to the different, the systematic difference. Um, one of the things that really stuck out to me was that everyone in India goes to private school. I've been raised on the idea that public school is incredible. I went to public school, elementary school, middle school, high school, and college. Um, so the, the fact that this would be such an abnormal, abnormality in India really shocked me. Um, what did I learn about myself? Um, I think I learned more about myself during the second interaction. Um, I, for, so for the second interaction, I brought Shiksa to the Hillel house, and I was nervous at first, and I think this is kind of like a negative part of myself because I feel like there really should be no nerves when it comes to sharing parts of your culture. Uh, I did learn, though, that through Shiksa and the way she interacted with the Hillel house, that it is important to share your culture. Um, like I've said in past vlogs, someone does not really need to be a part of a culture to appreciate it. Aspects of culture can transcend stereotypical boundaries, and I think that's something, I think through the negative, it's positive. Um... What am I going to do as an MSU student differently? Um, definitely going to try to be more inclusive, I think. I already try to be inclusive in everything that I do, but I do find that it's easy to get stuck in your habits, stuck in the way that things are, the way you, in the way that, that the culture you are is. Um, I think it's important to create a space where MSU students from all types of backgrounds and culture feel not only safe, but also appreciated and valued. <laughs> So how might this experience influence as a learner and as a possible educator? Um, so I think that this really expanded the class for me because I saw like topics that we've been discussing in class come to light. I think that cultural immersion is essential for education, and I think being uncomfortable is a very important part of education. And I think sharing culture can be uncomfortable, but you grow a lot because you gain you gain from being uncomfortable. But it's it's hard to become uncomfortable, but once you are, you can gain a lot from it. Um, so I think this just reinforced that for me, and this really, really told me that cultural immersion is important as an educator. And I definitely, like, in my future classroom, if I have students from different cultures, to make sure that all the cultures are being appreciated and valued the way that they should be. Overall, I really did enjoy this project and had a good time. Okay, so before we start the interaction, I was a little unsure, and I didn't really know, like, what's going to happen, or how to feel, or like what people's rea or her reaction is going to be. But like during when I was actually like talking about the schooling process, it was it was really interesting and I like really liked talking about it because I guess I've never really discussed it with someone that openly and like people who don't already know about that process. So like I felt like I was nervous before but then after and during the interaction it felt better and I kind of enjoyed doing that, going through that whole process. Um, I guess like one positive thing that I learned from it was how, how while we are from different cultures, we also have a lot of similarities and it was uh, great to experience that from someone who obviously didn't grow up in the same environment as I did, so I really enjoyed that. Um, as an MSU student, this, I would obviously look at MSU in a different light. There are a lot of different cultures represented here, and I feel like I would be able to connect with them more because of this process, and I really enjoyed it. Okay, so that's